hi to Chaco. That's a five zero zero. Russia versus Germany. Who's better? Is it Russia? Is it Germany? I don't know. We'll find out. We'll figure this out, guys. We'll figure this out. Death Note. He's from Russia. Ente. He's from Germany. We have an Archmage. We have a Death Knight. We have one patch 1.29. So, who's gonna be better in patch 1.29? Russia, go go Russia. We see some uh, some fans from Russia here in chat. Death Note, I mean, he's over here. Death Note going with the Archmage. No Mount King on this map. Good Deutschland. Good Deutschland. There's the Archmage. He attacks the Acolyte once and he's on his way. He's on his way and he's gonna creep this creep camp. Nice. He's going for the Ogre Warrior. The Ogre Warrior taking so much damage here. Archmage is doing a great job. This Ogre Warrior is dead. Does he pick up the circlet? He does pick it up. Now these uh, trappers. These trappers are going down. Death Knight is on his way. Do we see the early graveyard? Yes. On this map we always see early fiends. Always. Chaco, your German is so good. Thanks. Kevin swam. He kills a little sheep. It's not a uh, it's not a useless kill, guys. It's not a, a kill for no reason. He will summon skeletons from later, or at least that's what is what he was planning. But maybe he changed his mind because his Archmage is being so annoying, throwing fireballs at him. The Death Knight retreating. Do we get the first fiend yet? Not yet. He has the supply for it. He has 17 out of 20, guys, but he doesn't have the money yet. Not yet. He has a lumber. He just needs like 20 more gold and then we'll get the fiend. There it is. There's the fiend. Okay, the death knight with skeletons. He, he's, you know, <laughs> he's still over there. We do see the militia being called here. And the Archmage is going to summon this water elemental in a moment. Wait, where are his wa water elementals? Okay, I guess he didn't summon one in a while. Here he comes. Death Knight 0 XP, so let's see if he gets anything. Oh, he doesn't get the troll. The Archmage gets the troll. He's level 2 now. And maybe the Ogre Magi. He has plenty of mana. Oh, and he gets it. A nice 92 XP here. This militia, by the way, is super low on hit points. He, he should probably just kill himself. This is not going to survive. You're going to give 25 XP to the Death Knight. Uh, maybe. Okay, maybe not. Maybe, uh, you know what? The Skeptics don't get the kill. <laughs> but he almost prevented it from dying like or he almost forced a coil to be used of course a coil would have always killed the peasant but 75 mana you preferably uh, don't want to coil that five hit point peasant this town hall going up there's a the fiend by the way there's the first fiend there's the second fiend does he get the third fiend um yeah he's getting the third fiend there it is nice third fiend guys Death Knight, he wants level 2. He just needs like 4 more peasant kills and he's level 2. He almost gets his peasant. He needs level 2. The aura is pretty important since he's getting so low on hit points. Look how low he is. He needs the extra regeneration. This peasant survives 14 hit points. All he needs. Is he tier 2 yet? Almost. Acolyte scouting there still. Okay. So far, I feel like Death Knight did just find her. Like, the Death Knight... He got one level 5 ogre and he got one peasant. That's it, guys. Not a very good harass here by the Death Knight. Archmage here just killing some trolls. Replenishment potion. I mean, yeah, not really what he needs at the moment. But on the other, ma other hand, in this matchup, I feel like Sentry Wards aren't as nice. Usually you have a very good idea what Undead is doing because he's playing so aggressive in this matchup. He's always over here at your expansion. Uh, and the illusions, I mean, they're not amazing either in this matchup. So he's getting some nulls. Here comes, here he comes again. Here comes Death, uh, Enter. He has level two Death Knight. The Archmage hits level three. No Overseer's death and he picks up a circlet. And here's the Lich, by the way. There he is. He's going to tier 3. No slaughterhouse yet, but I'm sure he's going to build one pretty soon. Three fiends there. The Death Knight has to be careful. He got a Gloves of Haste. The Fiend, hello! Oh, he needs to go for this building and he gets it. Easy peasy. Saves the Fiend. 
There's a Nova here, kills a footman. There's a coil on the uh, fiend. The fiend is still alive, guys. Still alive. His Archmage does so much damage, plus 10 damage, and he has two circlets. I really would like to see a boost of speed on this Archmage. He can kill so many units. He's, <laughs> he's going first round on Death Knight, but he can't get it. The fiend here is also very low, or not low yet, but he takes a bit of damage. This other one's super low. This one, look. 13 hit points. He has to go back to the Blight. And do we get a fourth fiend or do we get a second slaughterhouse? I'm not sure yet. Last game. Wait, we saw an play against a uh, human before, right? Or did we? I feel like we did. And that game he went for more fiends. But this game he's going for the double slaughterhouse. Three fiend built. Okay. This death knight takes a lot of damage. His footman takes a bit of damage. Here comes the archmage with the water elemental. He's going for this fiend, this footman. He's doing just fine. Yeah, he has a healing potion now on the Death Knight over here, by the way, meanwhile. Lumber mill, fast build here. Does he need the lumber that badly? No. Does he need the guard towers that badly? I guess so. Or maybe the masonry. Let me just quickly look now. Yeah, he can build the guard towers now. And he's getting masonry. Footman is going back home. Or somewhere safe. This footman as well doesn't want to die yet. Okay, that's understandable, completely understandable, guys. Where's the third fiend? He, d he didn't die yet. Oh no, no, there he is. He's hiding in the back. <laughs> Such a cute little fiend. So this fiend is also gonna uh, mic your back, of course. Do we have more coils? We have one more coil, and he we have the orb now. Does he give it to the lich? No, he's too busy killing the archmage to give it to the lich. The archmage. Do we have a coil? We have a coil, but it's only level one. So the Archmage gets away with uh, 220 hit points. Goyo level 1 does 70 damage against the Archmage, guys. So not a lot. And he gives the orb now to the Lich. And he's going for destroyers. There's destroyer form. There's the destroyer. Uh, statue, I mean. This is only second statue, though. Here comes the Zeppelin harass. Here he comes, guys. Here he comes. More towers being built here. We have a uh, blacksmith going up. And here comes the zeppelin, guys. What item did he get? Healing wards. Mm, okay, could be useful. Could be useful. Here's a here's a drop. What elemental summon? Uh, Eclis immediately or. Pretty much immediately evacuated. This acolyte even survives. Here come the two destroyers. He morphed them both without uh, trying to get mana from one of the statues. And uh, you know, there's plenty of water metals here. The Death Knight is finally level 3. And the Lich is underway. No, Lich is not underway. I thought he was underway ready to the expansion. Or maybe he was and he uh, misclicked or something. These two footmen doing just great. Does he have web? I doubt it, right? Does he have web? He's pretending like he has web. No, he will get uh, killed though with the Lich. Okay, Destroyers actually got the kill, but still, same thing. This uh, one footman does go down. He eats a skeleton, so tasty. No, 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 no. Uh, only four towers. Okay, I mean, two more building. This one is going to be up here pretty soon. He has Masery level one. Is Masery level two almost done? Almost. He's a, it's a bit too late. Just a, a second too late. It might make a difference. Let's see. One tower goes down. This tower is uh, also down. This healing ward just healing. And of course, uh, Death Knight goes for the counter attack. He can't buy units here now, by the way, since uh, since anti crap that. So, like, a uh, Sepper would be nice if he has money for that. He does have money for a Sepper. And he has the supply as well. I would I would like to see some Seppers. I think only one is available. Like, if you use it over there, it would be fine. Or over here. He's just killing ghouls here. With the Archmage, the ghouls are supposed to just stand there and do nothing. Uh, Eclides over there, he sends back his destroyers after killing all the towers here. And, I mean, he's going for these uh, last two towers with the fiends and Death Knight and the Lich. And all the ghouls have been killed besides one, actually. One is still alive. Uh, Eclides in trouble. They want to repair the haunted gold mine. Here come the destroyers to save the day, guys. They can eat the water metal so fast. They get, get in a lot of mana and then kill the footmen. And meanwhile, over here, he's going for uh, the peasants first and the Death Knight going for the shredder. Okay. Usually, uh, oh, over here, the Archmage has to TP out. This, this footman is dead. Okay. 
Mount King and the Archmage will survive. And they TP to the main. There's flying machines being built. The flying machines are 0 0. And he's not upgrading them. Shredder went down. Do we see a panda for Ant at some point? He doesn't have the money now because, you know, he took some damage here. He might also want another ghoul again. Yes, oh, he has enough lumber for now. Archmage is pretty low. He has to be careful. Destroyers will still win the fight against four flying machines. Four destroyers against four flying machines. Easy peasy fight for destroyers, but he's building more. And there's a flat cannon, of course. And now he sees what's happening over here. What's this? Potion of greater mana. He, eats, he drinks a water metal. He's going for the Archmage. Hello, the Archmage is dying to destroyers. I've never seen that before. But the Archmage survives. The flying machine is dead. The Mountain King, uh, what is he doing here? Maybe buy a staff or something? Or, you know, just walk out, okay? But, you know, he might... You know, I don't know what he's planning to do here. Is he just planning to die to creeps? <laughs> or die to destroyers? Yeah, better die to the creeps. Um, I mean, Death Knight is level 4 now. Was he already level 4? I'm not sure. I feel like he died to creeps. But if the Death Knight just leveled up, he got the XP. Maybe you guys uh, paid attention to the level of the Death Knight. We have four destroyers here. We have uh, more flying machines. Anta is definitely winning this game. All he needs is a panda. I mean, even without a panda, he's probably fine. Some more flying machines. Here comes the uh, paladin and the archmage just saying hello. We can do anything over here. Oh, actually, eight flying machines. Is that enough to kill four destroyers? No, they have a little bit of mana now, right? Uh, this destroyer is Michael back here very skillfully. Do we have a coil uh, on the on the archmage, not on the destroyer, but that's fine. A uh, militia, he calls in all the militia. There's even no, there's are not gold mine peons. Uh, the stormbolt here on the fiend. The paladin is about to die. There's no staff. The archmage died already. I missed that uh, because I was looking at the militia. And I mean, he, I mean, this army looks pretty weak. Souls now supplies are pretty even, but but militia are dying to creeps. Hello, <laughs> maybe go back home, guys. Maybe go back home. You guys are no longer needed. Uh, the Mountain King is flying. Does he have more Wand of the Wind? Yeah. Can he surround the Mountain King? Of course he can. But there it is. GG. Death Note GG's out. And the first game goes to end. What an exciting best of five already. Crypt. What else do we have here? We have a Ziggurat. We have a Tomb of Relics. Oh, look at this beautiful map. Look at this beautiful map, guys. It is a beautiful Wednesday. And we have a beautiful map here with the... Okay, with the beautiful sand, you know, and like a little bit of uh, grass. What is? Oh, oh, run, hermit crab! Better run! Oh no, this hermit crab! I, I fear for the worst, guys. You should be running. Go, guys! Go! Uh, oh, Echolord! Oh no! Three hit points. Can he get away? No! He's dead. Okay. There's a death knight. He's getting ghouls as well. Getting more ghouls. Does he get the early graveyard this game? No, right? If he went for graveyard, he already went for the graveyard. We didn't go for a graveyard. I don't know the undead builds exactly. But I feel like he is going for later graveyard than last game. Oh, by the way, that... Oh, come on, overlay. Come on. This death knight is for Ante. That makes sense. That makes so much sense, Jaco. Okay, the Archmage, he got a nice Gloves of Haste from this creep camp. He attacks the Archmage, uh, Death Knight once, he attacks him again. Death Knight with uh, skeletons, he's going for a peasant. This peasant is in trouble. We have a uh, Acolyte scouting over here. I'm not sure exactly how strong this creep camp is. We have a Cobalt, level one Cobalt, and it's just the entire Cobalt family. Okay. That's nice. He's building more food, man. I wonder if Death Note knows exactly how many militia he needs to creep this safely. But here come the ghouls. Six ghouls. He's building a seventh ghoul. He's not even uh, building a graveyard or attacking. There's two geomancers there. One tunneler, one taskmaster. And one little baby kobold. <laughs> What a nice family here. This Acolyte is standing uh, over here as well. It's gonna help out the Kobolds. No, he takes the Kobolds. That's not smart. Now the Acolyte uh, got slowed instead of the Footman. 
There goes a Geomancer. There goes the other Geomancer. Tome of Intelligence on the floor. The Archmage is doing just fine. Uh, summons a Water Metal. Meanwhile, more units are dying. This militia should probably go back home. Uh, because he's gonna die if he stays here. The Death Knight just attacks him and kills him. 25, 58 XP, 142. He gets a level 5 as well, again. And the Archmage, he wants the items. The Ring of Protection and the Tome of Intelligence. There goes a Ghoul. Do we have Backpack? I mean, if you have so many Ghouls, maybe get Backpack. Wait, who? Oh, he killed the item. Someone killed the item. I assume it's Death Note because the Archmage is over here. So he realizes, hey, I cannot pick up the item. So I killed it. Uh, over here, Footman finding against this Ghoul. This Ghoul is... Is that the coil missed? Oh no, what a bad coil. But he's gonna hit almost level 2 here in a moment. One more footman kill, or one more water elemental kill would be it. Uh, there gets another peasant, but that's not enough. Oh, and he kills something else. He's not level 2. Archmage gets away. And this acolyte, though, is dead. Wow, and there's the tower. He has a uh, building this with a, a gold sack in his, you know, on his back. And look at this Archmage. Chaco, ready for Nettie's 1.29 tomorrow. I'm not sure if I'm ready, we'll see. This uh, Archmage is almost level 3. He's going for this ghoul. This ghoul is taking some damage, guys. Can he kill the ghoul? No, there's coil. There's a coil available. Melissa killing the ghoul, guys. This ghoul is... Oh, coil on the peasant, he's dead. This ghoul is pretty dead as well, though. Level 3 Archmage, that's of course a major... Uh, level up here for the Archmage and now we are attacking here at least Ant is and he has a graveyard as well Death Knight attacks the Archmage And again Archmage should be able to get away I think <laughs> I mean, unless he can... No, there's no way he can creep with the ghouls to level 3. He's too far away from level 3. Ghouls just walking past the footman. I mean, maybe the ghouls can cut off the Archmage. There's a panda for Anta. And there's a one guard tower, but no arcane tower. These peasants in trouble. But the footman is going for the counterattack. There's the Ziggurat. Do we have defend? Not yet, I think. But there's no way to check, of course. The Archmage... <sighs> Coil to 70 damage, guys. Is at 81 hit points, and of course the Death Knight has better movement speed. He might have the TP here. And what was I checking for? Oh yeah, defend. No defend being upgraded right now. The Archmage running for his life. The Panda here with the ghouls. Uh, look at this. The Archmage has the TP. Did he dodge the coil? He didn't dodge the coil. Uh, maybe he figured he had to micro something else. Oh no, Archmage! Hello. Bye bye. Bye bye. Just kill the Archmage. Hello. There goes the Archmage. Meanwhile, Footman over here. They killed, did they kill any uh, acolytes? Maybe one? He's built, oh, two acolytes, I guess. He's building two more acolytes. But the footman without defend have to retreat. The panda killed something. He didn't kill a lot here. See, two dead peasants and a dead ghoul. It's not like the panda has skeletons of three dead peasants, four or five dead peasants now in total. And uh, I mean, he's just killing more stuff here. Kills another peasant. And these footmen, I mean, this footman is going to die. Where? He's three footmen retreating. Just say bye bye to this Mr. Peasant. Archmage back from the tavern, guys. Beautiful fighting here by the panda. Breath of Fire. The last one for a while. Uh, he, did he just coil the footman? Yeah. And the footman is dead. Now he's killing more peasants. The, the Archmage is right clicking this uh, Death Knight. He has gloves of haste, so he attacks pretty fast. In fact, he attacks fast. Not just pretty fast. What's happening over here? Why is this footman dying here to the creeps? He's dead. Where? These two footmen very long hit points. I mean, Death Note, it doesn't look very good for Death Note, guys. It looks like he's gonna die again. Double Slaughterhouse is going up. We see uh, Ant attacking to tier 3. What does Death Note have? 23 supply. Tier 1. He has some low hit point footmen. I mean, it's gonna be difficult. It's gonna be difficult for Death Note. If Death Note wins this game, I'll eat three rice cakes, guys. And not just one by one. I'll make a, a rice cake burger, guys. And I'll, I'll eat it live on stream. A rice cake burger made of three rice cakes. It's gonna be delicious. And it's gonna be exciting for you guys to watch. So. I'm putting a lot on the line here. The Death Knight level 3? 
Panda level 2. Nice fountain. This peasant building tower. Here comes, uh, here comes Skeletus. Oh, he kills the little hermit crab. There was no reason, really. There were still bodies over there. And let's see. The panda. Breath of fire. Peasants here are going to die. Because that's what they're doing when they're next to ghouls and skeletons. A uh, lot of them dying. Wah, wah, wah. Oh, one ghoul. I heard one ghoul die. There he is. He's dead. The death knight, I mean, he has a TP in worst case scenario, but he's just coiling. This footman kills the footman. The other footman does retreat. There's just an archmage and a low hit point footman. And now some militia gonna help out a little bit. Two water elementals. That's pretty nice. This tower gets cancelled though. And this tower is going up. No arcade tower. He really needs one arcane tower. Still the tier one, meanwhile. He has a shredder though. Wah! There goes a ghoul. There goes a skeleton. There goes another skeleton, and there goes another skeleton. Okay. Well, the Death Knight is healing here with the Panda. Panda second, by the way, now that I uh, think about it. It's not standard, of course. Normally you get the Panda third, but he, he saw an opportunity. The Panda second, what does it mean? So if you get a hero, a tavern hero, you can get a tavern hero a bit faster than a hero from your altar. Like a hero from your altar... Like the moment you reach hit, uh, tier two, right? You can build a hero from your altar. It's gonna take some time before he comes out, and then when he comes out, you have to walk all the way from over here to all the way over here. Well, on the other hand, if you get the tavern hero, the panda, for example, the moment you hit tier two, you go to the tavern, you click the panda, he sh shows up immediately, and he only has to move from there to here. And the panda is uh, has great AOE effect, breath of fire. His peasants, his footman, his towers, it's uh, a very nice hero, guys against human apparently we still so don't see any dreadlords we saw one dreadlord today but that player lost no dreadlords in this matchup not yet at least maybe in the future there's a destroyer he drinks mana from this statue now we have another destroyer he drinks mana from this statue now with three destroyers good luck everyone wish death Note some good luck because he <laughs> needs some good luck guys he needs to get super lucky i don't even know how like, what kind of luck does he need? Like, this tower needs to do 27 damage every attack. This one as well. Uh, the tower's already gone. There's one tower left. And there's a water metal here that he can eat here with the destroyers. And that's what he does. He drinks it and he, he takes it down. The Archmage here go, trying to get this uh, destroyer down to low hit points. Nice breath of fire. These peasants are all dying. The towers go up. But it doesn't matter because the peasants are all dead. The towers can be killed here by the destroyers. The panda is almost level 3. There it is, level 3. Level 3 panda is going for this tower next. Rebel fire, tower's gone, death knight's level 4. Uh, he's going for the town hall, he doesn't even care about the archmage. Okay, he cares about the archmage now. No, he doesn't care about the archmage, guys. He has the coils, and I mean, he's just gonna kill the town hall. Meanwhile, we're going to tier 2. Death knight, okay, GG, Echo Owls. GG, Echo Owls, guys. Second game goes to Anta. For uh, Anta, and the crypt, and the tomb of relics. Here we have an Archmace for Death Note. Hopefully Death Note can at least win a game or two. Actually, he has to win this game if he wants to win a game or two. Because if Anta wins this, it's over, guys. It would be 3-0 for Anta. There's a Footman, and there's an Archmace, and more Footman. Blade lost to Todd yesterday, though. Wait, in a, on letter? Blade played Moo Cup on Monday. He played 1.29 then. Okay, that means he has 1.29 installed. We have a footman. We have a death knight. And a ghoul. A player's force. Again, he's going for uh, pretty heavy on the ghouls. No graveyard. I mean, it worked well last game. But whatever he did first game also worked pretty well. Here's the acolyte. And he acolyte going for the archmage. Archmage takes a bit of damage from the Acolyte. The Acolyte doing so much damage against the Archmage. The Archmage has a circlet though. He doesn't die very easily. And the Militia and the Footman can save the Archmage by killing the Acolyte. And he dies. And there's a coil on the... Nothing. I mean, he, he missed. So, 0 XP still on the Death Knight. He does, will get this uh, Peasant, I'm sure. Or, am I sure? Maybe someone can save him. No, a Peasant! Come on, you saw that the Skeleton. Maybe he could have saved the Peasant. With a bit better micro. We have a Lannister here. He's level 2. He's just continuing creeping, sure. Uh, the skeleton, wherever it went. Oh, there. It went down. So 25 XP, right? Yeah, 25 XP. There's only the one peasant. 
Archmage running away from some skeletons. He has a mantle of intelligence. Very nice item for extra damage, extra water elementals, extra intelligence. Does he get XP? No, the tower killed the skeleton. What a waste. 12 XP wasted. And he's getting more ghouls. He has six ghouls. Here he comes. He's building a seventh ghoul. Here he comes, guys. Here comes Enter. Of course, Death Note, he wants to creep this creep camp. Uh, to get his expansion up. This peasant, though, is gonna die. He's dead. Here comes the Death Knight with the skeletons. This peasant also is dead. This peasant might might survive. At least uh, the creeps. But the coil. Killed by the coil. Now we have 50 XP here on the Death Knight. And there goes another peasant. Hello, he just lost like four peasants. And more peasants are going to die. And it's gonna get the golem. Okay, the Archmage gets the golem at the least. Uh, the item as well, but. Two more peasants dead. Well, this one. Uh, yeah, two more peasants dead. So he's down six peasants. Hello. The death that only got. Uh, wait, what? 125 XP now. So he got a lot of those peasants. But he got five peasant skills. Okay. Uh, there. The ghoul goes down. So that means he has lost seven peasants, right? Uh, one ghoul is dead. Because he didn't get XP for two peasants. And he did get XP for five peasants. So seven peasants dead, guys. Seven peasants. Is that correct? Is it even true? We see four here. No, five. And he lost two early game, right? Yeah, so seven peasants. Or did he only lose one early game? Well, he has 125 XP. So uh, the ghoul here going back home. The death knight, he wants level two. Does he get... Uh, well, he's going to kill three more peasants. That's how he's going to get level two. Hello. The ghouls, they could go to the main as well. There's only one uh, arcane tower there. And here, this is well defended. And I mean, the Death Knight with more skeletons, he went to buy more skeletons. He doesn't use backpack. Interesting here. Interesting play by the Enter. Playing without backpack. That's why the Death Knight had to buy skeletons himself. These skeletons going for this peasant. How many coils does he have? One coil. These ghouls going for this skeleton. The Arch Death Knight going for the Archmage. I'm not sure. He should probably go for that peasant. Okay, he's going for it now. This ghoul here um, dies. He doesn't use the coil on the ghoul. This peasant's still alive. There goes another ghoul. He needed one more peasant. He could have probably coiled one, but he wants to save this ghoul. Okay. And this peasant is going to die. Or is the skeleton going to die? The skeleton dies. The peasant's still alive with seven hit points. The death knight almost blocked by the footman, but not quite. Uh, and the death knight is, get, is level two now. 200 XP. That means eight peasants. And I think two peasants uh, died without getting a, uh, giving any XP. So... Eight peasants, uh, ten peasants dead already at uh, what minute mark? Six minute mark, and now he's gonna kill more peasants. So, I think that's a lot of peasants that uh, died so far, and that's pretty bad for Death Note. Death Note, uh, the Death Knight. Hello, Death Note, Death Knight. All these words so similar. Is uh, coming back with the panda again, by the way. So, um, I hate to say it, but I think we're gonna see you three zero. At least he got one map against Happy. He also got one map against Lucifer, although Lucifer kind of gave him that map. But it seems like um, he won't get one map against Anta, guys. There's a Breath of Fire. There goes the tower again. Uh, or again, the tower is gone. Uh, okay, well, Death Note. You know what? If Death Note manages to win this game, I won't eat a triple rice cake burger. I'll eat a quadruple rice cake burger. Wow, I'm, I'm raging even more, guys. Putting in so much into this game. I mean, the Archmage is level 3. That's nice. He's almost level 4. He killed a few ghouls, right? He killed a few ghouls. He killed, like, uh, like what? Four ghouls? I didn't count the ghouls. Maybe I should have counted the ghouls as well. The skeleton's gonna kill more peasants. Sure, why not? You know, that's what skeletons do. They kill more peasants. And, I mean, there's a breath of fire. What's the Archmage doing here? He's creeping. Okay. Yeah. He could maybe cancel Slaughterhouse. Or wait, he wasn't planning to creep. It was probably an accident somehow. So, a lot of skeletons over here. That's nice. Uh, water Metal will go down. The Archmage has to be careful not to get surrounded by six ghouls. Double Slaughterhouse is up. Not a single fiend was made. Because why would you make a fiend if you can just win the game with destroyers? Yeah. Why, uh, why build the fiend? The Death Knight and the Panda just attack the Shredder once. Shredder coming back, you know. And Panda's level 2. Does he go for critical strike? Why not? 
Who secrets? I don't secret yet. Or maybe he's going haste. Definitely takes a bit of damage, but... Um, yeah, he's gonna be fine. He's gonna be fine. Shredder gets out. Can he escape? There's no mana for Breath of Fire. Can someone block this panda, please? This peasant, for example. There was already kind of blocking the panda, but not quite. Oh, the Shredder misses. He does have uh, critical strike, guys. He has Drunk Brawler. And oh, the Zeppelin picks up the Shredder. That's nice. That's so nice. This is definitely worth the investment of the Zeppelin. Shredder is uh, more expensive than the Zeppelin. And the Death Knight over here. So what's he going to do against these destroyers? Mass Towers? I guess it's going to be Mass Towers. But is he going to be in time? I doubt it. <laughs> because this is his first tower. His first tower. Does he have Masery? No. No Masery. Which makes sense because... Why would you get Masery if you don't have towers? The Lannister attacks the Mushi Ailharth a little bit. Death Knight at home. And four destroyers incoming, guys. Pretty soon. <laughs> Pretty soon. And he's uh, he's building towers. He's building towers. Archimate. Okay, Mr. Horsey goes down. The Death Knight gets a gloss of haste. Does he uh, no third hero? No, no. Spirit Tower here for defense. Death Knight and the Panda. Doing a lot of damage against his footman. His footman, is he going to die? Coil kills the footman. The water elemental here is also taking a lot of damage. He's gone. He's gone as well. Death Knight's level three. Panda's level two. The skeleton here, okay, the statue here takes a bit of damage. Nice 62 critical strike there by Mr. Panda. 62, that feels like a true blade master. That feels like a blade master from last patch even. There's a tome of strength on the floor, maybe someone can pick it up, like the death knight. He's close anyway. You, oh no, he's going for the surround on the water in the middle. Four destroyers here. He morphs them one for one so he can get as much mana on them as possible. And four destroyers, is that enough? I'm not sure actually. Without the Death Knight there, without the Panda there, that might not be enough. And do we see Seppers here? You can buy a Sepper. Let's see if it's enough. Uh, are these towers almost up? Uh, not quite. I guess it is enough. Maybe. Let's see if we. Uh, yeah, I guess it is enough. Peasants here dying. Uh, not completely enough. These three towers, they might be able to hold. If this one just gets up a little bit faster, hello! Over here, meanwhile. The Death Knight, okay. Death Knight, okay. He's going for the water metal. Water metal is surrounded. And the destroyers, they do retreat. Is there Masery yet, by the way? There is, ma oh yeah, Masery level one. I think I already mentioned that. Uh, Death Knight here, he wants his footman. He doesn't want his footman. The panda is almost level three, but not quite. Okay. Uh, destroyer is gonna kill some footman. You know why not? Footmen are pretty much like walking XP tomes. There it goes one. This one is going next. Uh, kill it. Uh, meanwhile, over here. Things are going to die. Nice breath of fire. Kills a lot of units. This uh, Shredder is cutting down some trees. He's going to tier 2. He's not even close to tier 2, guys. Here comes a TP in by the Archmage and the one footman. Nice defense here. Nice defense force. Uh, he kills the ghoul before the coil reaches. What a nice comeback here, maybe, Kappa. This water metal goes down. I just got a message from my fires and threat protection that I don't have any fires on my computer, guys. Uh, glad you guys know that. There goes one tower. This tower is also gone, guys. This destroyer is my... No, it's dead, guys. It's a dead destroyer, but there's more destroyers. Five destroyers. Is that enough against one tower? The tower has masonry upgrade. There's a breath of fire. The militias and the footmen taking so much damage. This, uh... These destroyers, they kill a footman. And, I mean, this footman is going down, guys. This footman, is it going down? Meanwhile, the Death Knight and the Panda killing shit over there. GG's. GG's. And Anta wins 3 to 0. Anta goes to the Hydro Chaco League, guys. He's the third and that. We have three and that. We have one Melancholy so far. We have Lucifer, Happy, uh, Anta, and Melancholy.